Hello, what's going on guys? Welcome to Backstreet's YouTube channel. I'm your host, Kelvin Liu. This is a channel where we talk about bags, do bag reviews, give tips related to bag, and all that sort of good stuff. In this episode, we're going to be looking at these bags and compare the Anello Dense Malted Polyester Hinge Cleft Backpack, Macaroon Classic Blueberry, and the Piel Raven Konkan Fox Stripe. But before that, let's roll that intro. So before I start this video, please do note that this is not an apple to apple comparison. These bags alone can represent the whole lineup of the brand. Each of the brand, they got some different variation. These are just the bags that I managed to get. And the reason why I choose them is because this model are the common one. And I'm not here to review the bag because you can tell that I definitely uh, don't own all of these bags and never used them before. These are brand new bags that I just unboxed. I'm here just to give you guys a quick overview and a comparison between these bags. With that out of the way, let's kickstart this video. So firstly, let's talk about the common features that three of them have. As you can tell, all of them look similar with squarish kind of design, you know, and they all have top handle with button. Uh, you can switch them between backpack and handbag if you wanted to. And they all have a front pocket they all have side water bottle compartment all of them can fit in a 13 inch macbook pro so let's try them out man yep you definitely can no problem at all and this is the only one that has laptop compartment Yep, no problem as well. All right, let's talk about these bags one by one. Just a quick introduction about these brands. Let's start with the Anello first. Anello is a Japanese bag brand and this is an Anello Dance Malted Polyester Hinge Claps Backpack. Such a long name, man. Anello has gotten its name because of its high functionality and convenience, such as the hinge claps, uh, which can be opened widely and stand easily by itself. This is a macaron classic blueberry. Donut is originally from Hong Kong. People love it because of its overall design, you know, the ability to open wide as well, the leather belt kind of design, and tons of inner compartment, which we are going to talk about just in a second and smooth fabric it is really comfortable and very smooth if you don't believe me you can try and buy one and touch it yourself it's just so smooth it it barely makes any sound at all it's like cuddling a baby you know fiel raven concan fiel fiel raven concan you know if i mispronounce it please don't attack me you know it, it is not easy to pronounce this go and try it out yourself you know it's not easy a lot of people misspell the name and I, I think I'm pretty close. Fiel Raven is a Swedish company and was founded in 1960. And this is the original Konkan since 1978. We got an old man in the house, yo. This design is literally older than most of us here. Let us now check out the material for each of them. This Anello is made of polyester, you know, although they claim that this is a waterproof back my opinion is waterproof is slightly misleading term here may have been lost somewhere in translation from japanese to english you know none of their bags can go underwater with the contents remaining dry i will say that this is water resistant meaning they'll be fine uh, if you're out in the rain for a short period of time and generally uh, they repel water this donut macaron classic is made of water resistant heavy true material and the material is really smooth as compared to two of these. This Kankan is made of 100% polypropylene and vinylone F, 100% uh, vinyl. I felt like the material is quite rough, you know, but, uh, but it feels like it can survive a knife cut. It is very thin, but you know, the material seems very robust. Let us now look at the front pocket here. It is pretty straightforward. Um, you can tell that the Anello and Kankan is secured by a zipper and the Macaron Classic has a real leather belt 
kind of design. You don't actually need to undo the belt. You just need to unbutton them like that to assess them and just snap them back once you're done. Yeah, simple as that. Now let's check out the weight of each bag. I'm pretty good at judging the weight by bare hands. So let's see. Anello one is a weight around 780 gram. Donut weight around 700 gram. And Kan Kan weight around 300 gram. Of course, I'm just kidding. I memorized the weight, okay? Let us look at the dimensions of each bag. Anello depth is uh, 17 centimeters, 40 centimeters in height, and 20 centimeters in width. The donut's depth is 11 centimeters and 37 centimeters in height and 28 centimeters in width. Kanken's depth is 13 centimeters. Height is 38 centimeters. Width is 27 centimeters. Next, let's check out the shoulder strap. And from what I can see here, donut one is slightly thicker, uh, but anello one is slightly wider. Yep. And also, Kanken and Donut have this button here, you know, to secure the remaining straps. If you shorten the shoulder strap, uh, this will prevent the remaining strap from it touching the ground. And Anello doesn't have that button. Just to give you an idea here, both of the strap buckle of Anello and Kanken is made of plastic, and the Donut one is made of metal. So let us move on to the most exciting part, compartments. Let's start with the Nello first. Unbutton the top handle, unzip them, assess them just like that. And by the way, you can assess them from the back as well, from this back zipper right here. This zipper here, it's not a separate compartment. It actually reaches the back of the main compartment. So you don't have to go all the way to the top to assess the main compartment. Some other donuts, Backpack has the side access to the main compartment as well, but not uh, the Macaron Classic. Once you open them up, you can see everything inside the back and it stands upright. I can see there are two inner compartments right here. One of that is uh, probably for phone. This is where the Macaron Classic stood out a little because as you can see, there are tons of inner compartments here. I've counted and there are seven compartments all together. You got this zipper compartment here, this compartment secured by the Velcro, this phone compartment, this mesh pocket here. There are two stretchable water bottle compartment and the laptop compartment. So if you are a organized freak, you definitely need this bag. So the Kanken one is pretty straightforward because you know, you, you got only one large main compartment. And what you can see here, this is actually not a laptop compartment. This is actually came with this seat pad and this can also act as a pad for the back panel. It feels so much better if you leave the seat pad inside or else you will be able to feel the stuff uh, through the backpack because the material is pretty thin. And also, Kanken -Kan is selling a lot of accessories like the shoulder pads, uh, the organizer. So don't worry if you are an organized freak and you still wanted to buy this bag. All right, there we have it, a comparison between the Anello, Donut, and the Fial Raven Kanken -Kan backpacks. As always, if you find this video helpful, please gently smash that like button, subscribe to our channel, turn on that notification bell so that we will be together until the end of the world. Bye. Fiel Raven, Fiel, Fiel Raven, Fiel, Fiel Raven, Fiel Raven, Conken, Fiel Raven, Fiel Raven, Conken, Fiel, One Eternity Later, Fiel Raven, Conken. Okay.